So hi guys, welcome to our very very um, new um, video tutorial. So gagawa tayo ngayon ng isang Mother's Day cake roll. So meron siyang decorative print na flower sa labas na naka-embed or naka-embos dun sa loob ng ating cake. So instead na pinapipe mo siya after mo i-bake, ipapipe natin siya before baking para kasabay siya ng ating cake roll. So the ingredients for this recipe are So for the decorative print, we have jersey butter pan, we have icing sugar, we have cake flour, we have egg whites and your assorted food color. Tapos for the cake, we have egg yolks, we have white sugar, vegetable oil, jersey UHT milk or jersey full cream milk. We have iodized salt, cake flour, egg whites, white sugar. And for the filling, we have our Vivo whipping cream and our canned fruit filling. So the first step we're gonna make is to make our um, decorative print. So for the decorative print, I'm making flowers and a bouquet. So ito siya. So mukha lang siyang shuttlecock pag malayo. Pero bouquet ng flowers. Medyo nabasa lang din siya. And then we have, I'm gonna make many colors for this. And so the first step you're gonna do is to mix in your butter, your sugar, and your flour. Okay, so first mix in your softened butter plus your sugar and your flour until well mixed na siya. Okay, kapag parang paste na siya, you can add in your eggs. And mix well until um, all the egg whites are well combined. Okay. When the mixture is smooth, you divide it into uh, separate containers. Kasi do natin siya kukulayan. Okay. Once you're done with the mixture, you divide your um, decorative print batter into your different containers. Into your different containers so that you can color them. So what I'll be using are liquid food color. You can use powdered or gel. Okay, so I'll be using seven colors. So let's divide the batter into seven containers. So remember, yung iba hindi naman kailangan sobrang dami. Kasi depende pa din sa amount no? Ang um, kukulaya nung print. And then, you put food color into each, you know, container. So yun, I'll be putting red dun sa pinakamadami. Okay, so after coloring your um, batter, you just put them inside piping bags. So I have paper cones a while ago and then I added them inside. So now, what you're gonna need, you're gonna need one, this one is 9 by 13, 9 by, no, I think this is 9 by 12. And then you print your own stencil. I have my bouquet. You can do hearts, you can do I love mom, you can do, um, plain circles and then you put it inside your pan so isagad mo yung isang part sa dulo tapos you put your parchment paper on top of it tapos ito trace natin kasi using our what do you call this our decorative print pattern batter that's it and then we will start piping first Let's do the flowers. So for the flowers, I'm gonna, I'm not gonna do the one in the middle anymore. Just be using my blue and the purple ones. So you just snip off a portion of this and then you trace. After that, the other colors naman. Oops, sorry. For the other colors, this one is, what do you call this color? This one is purple. And then you continue with the rest. 
So after piping your stencil, after piping everything, you put it inside the freezer. That was freeze for about mga 30 minutes or more. <laughs> so ayan na siya. Okay, freeze na lang. Okay. So habang fini freeze natin yung ating decorative print, we will now do our cake base. So for the cake, we're going to do first our egg yolks, egg yolk mixture. So first thing we're going to do is to mix in our, actually whisk, our egg yolks and our sugar. Yung sugar na gagamitin natin, yung mas malaking quantity. Okay? And our vanilla. If you're gonna use your stand mixer for this, much better. Pero isa lang kasi yung bowl ko at tinatamad ako magpugas mamaya. So ayan, your egg yolks, your sugar, and your vanilla. And you whisk. Fluffy. You whisk until light, light, light na sa and fluffy. After mixing for some time, magiging sobrang light na niya. So, kung kanina nakita niyo, manilaw-nilaw pa. Ngayon, sobrang pale na niya. Okay? Now, you can add your oil, your vegetable oil, and your Jersey UHT milk or Jersey full cream milk. And mix. And last, fold in your flour, or uh, cake flour, and your salt. And set it aside. So, with your stand mixer or hand mixer, make a meringue using your egg whites and your sugar. So, yung sugar yung mas malit na quantity, okay? So, put in your egg whites first. Tapos, whisk it until frothy. So, whisk until frothy. Kapag frothy na sa, tapos medyo maliit na yung bubbles, you can add in your sugar. Sugar. And whip until medium. Kapag na-achieve mo na yung medium peaks, you fold it into your um, egg yolk mixture. So, half muna. And then you fold. You put in the other half. Once your mixture is well mixed na, pour it over your frozen uh, descriptive print. Okay? And decorative print pala. So, ayan. Once it is done, you pour it over your frozen decorative print. So, do this immediately. Lalo na ngayon, sobrang init. Nakaka-stress. Kaya baka matunaw yung print mo kapag pinatagal mo siyang nakalabas. To the sides. And cover all of your prints. Okay? After that, do not top out. Tapos, you bake it immediately at 180 for about 10 to uh, 8 to 10 minutes. Okay? 180 degrees Celsius. So, after um, baking your cake, you pull it down. Tapos, make sure you mold mo yung cake dun sa ilalim para humiwala yung print niya dun sa um, parchment paper. Okay? Now, we will do our whipping cream. So, ito hindi ko na kasi siya roll kasi hindi naman siya matigas na mag-break siya kagaya ng iba na sobrang nag-break. Ito kung mag-break may mga konting breaks lang. Okay? So, for the whipping cream na filling natin, I'm gonna use mango na puree for the flavoring kasi, well, mango yung favorite ng nanay ko. <laughs> Joke lang. Maraming po kasi mangga sa amin ngayon. Pero you can use whatever filling you want to add inside. Now, you put a uh, whipping cream. So, ako mga ubusin ko na lang to. Kaunti na lang to ay. Wala akong ibang i-add na um, ang tawag dito na sweetener maliban dun sa ating puree. Next, we will whip this cream muna. Yeah. 
After whipping, get your cake. And then you put your cream inside. Ay, on top of your cake. Hindi siya kailangan makapal. Tsaka hindi siya kailangan sagad na sagad dun sa dulo. So first, yung dito muna sa sides. Make sure na abot siya hanggang dito sa dulo. Pero yung dito mag-leave ka ng isang inch na space, okay? Tapos you add in your mangoes. And then you drizzle this on top. So, pwede hindi naman yung buo yung lalagyan mo. Pwede yung gitna lang. Para hindi siya sobrang tara. Okay. And then you roll. So, to roll, alalay lang. Alalay lang sa side. And sa center. Tapos, you put it in the middle. Or in your needle. Kita nyo, hindi naman siya nag-break. Tapos, para mapantay nyo siyang bilog na bilog, nagkamitin ko po itong ano namin yun. Tapos, press mo lang yung sides ng parchment para ma-ensure na bilog siya. Okay? And, ayan. Tapos, i-wrap mo lang siya, tapos i-chill mo. As you can see, nakita mo yung mga pinayip ko kanina na flowers, sa bouquet. So, ayan. This one is for my mother. And then, I'm gonna cut later. Tapos, isa sir na lang. Okay. So, after um, cooling it or chilling it inside the chiller or refrigerator, kapag after mo siyang palamigin para mag-set na lahat ng kanyang cream inside, pwede mo na siya i-slice. So, after nun, pwede mo pa siya toppingan ng icing on top. Pero, ako hindi ko nalalagyan. Kasi, gusto kong pakita yung print niya. Okay? Kung kayo, gusto yung lagyan ng happy birthday outside, it's okay. Or hearts, other flowers, sunflower, ganyan. Or yun kahit anong lang design na gusto yung ilagay. Okay? Tapos yung filling din, sa inyo na nakadepende yun. Pwede nyo lagyan ng ganache using Van Houten Professional Compounds or Calibo Products. Tapos yung cream na gagamitin nyo is Vivo Whipping Cream. Since it's very, very stable kahit na sobrang ingat ng panahon. Okay? So, ayan. This one has a mango filling. Nabalitaan ko kasi medyo maasin daw yung mangga. Pero try natin. Maka yung nakain lang ng kuya ko. Sarap. Pwede para sa matanda. Pwede sa mga bata kasi hindi siya sobrang tamis. Depende din sa fruit sa mga gamit nyo. Kasi yan. Pwede fruit salad yung ilagay nyo sa loob. Mmm. Asin nga. Hahaha. Ayan. Ayan. So, that's all this is the... Please roll with decorative print. Okay?